Welcome to Phuket International Airport. Welcome to Phuket, guys. to Phuket International Airport. Here's the taxi minibus. Small kiosks where you can uh, buy a cheap transport for your hotel or wherever you want to go. For example, Patong is 180 baht. It's very hot. As soon as you come out, you feel the humidity. Just arrived to Phuket International Airport and we're about to take this um, minibus thingy to our hotel in Patong. Welcome to Patong Resort in Patong, Phuket. This is the lobby of our hotel. It's very spacious. Uh, I think it's a four-star four-star resort. And this is gonna be our home for the next two weeks. There's a lot of cute decorations. This hotel is a walking distance to 7-Eleven, massage shops and even nightlife. And here on the left, it's a bar. Uh, if you come up between 3 p.m. and 6 p.m., uh, you'll get a happy hour. So happy hour is when drinks are half price, sometimes even more. Our hotel package includes breakfast every morning for the stay of about two weeks, as well as return tickets and accommodation. So we bought everything as a package and it was a really good price. And I will talk about price later in the end of this video. Follow me guys, we are going to our room now. I will show you something inside the room. I'll do a small room tour. Let me know in comments uh, if you would stay here or not and what do you think about this resort, Patong Resort. Massage. Put the key. Put the key in a thingy. This one has a miniature garden. It's not like the balcony in other ones. Oh, and this one has a bathtub. Wow. 
and actually has a bathtub. The one had just a shower. Beautiful bed, TV, mini fridge, coffee, tea, complimentary water. And the best part is the private balcony. God, it's night time, but also we'll film during daytime. Really nice. Pretty big. It has a beautiful view of the garden. Feels like you're in the house. Hotel premises during daytime. Actually, a lot of nice spots for Instagram and nice photos. Uh, we also had a swimming pool and a really nice outdoor showers next to swimming pool. It's a nice place to just go for a walk and relax. And also, there were uh, even koi fishes, uh, real koi fishes uh, in a um, next to the bridge in a fountain. Swimming pool is just there. There's a swimming pool and a spa, and it literally next to our hotel room. Uh, Patong Resort also had a gym. It wasn't very big, but it was enough for me to do my cardio. And outside, um, there were some weights, free water and towels available as well. Say hello to koi fishes, guys. You can actually feed them. If you go to reception and ask them for some fish food, you can feed koi fishes. Unfortunately, we didn't have enough time to do it, but I saw some people doing it, so make sure you do it. And now, let's go have some breakfast. I will show you breakfast in Patong Resort. Follow me, guys. Breakfast is really good here. For the price, it's actually really good. A lot of choices from Asian breakfast to um, Western breakfast. You can find anything and you can order your own omelette and they can boil you an egg or fry an egg for you as well. This resort was very multicultural, especially I saw a lot of tourists from Arab countries and a lot of Russians. This friendly Thai chef can make you an omelette, fry you an egg, or boil you an egg. Whatever you desire, just ask him. Egg corner. Next, we are moving to tea and coffee station. Here you can make hot chocolate, tea, coffees, lattes, cappuccinos. And here it's a vegetarian corner. So if any of you guys vegetarians, this is your station. Also, it had some Indian food. Vegetarian any corner. Indian uh, cuisine lovers, you should be here.
The place even had dragon fruit, pineapple melon and rock melon. It's funny because um, someone actually complained about um, not having an ice cream for breakfast, but I think it's a little bit too much. What do you think, guys? Should breakfast include ice cream or not? Because we were visiting during low season, which is wet season, sometimes it was raining, but for a very short period of time. On level 8, yep. uh, Patong Resort has a Japanese bar and a restaurant with live uh, music sometimes. So we decided to give it a go and just have some drinks and maybe order something later on as well. This is the place. And here is the view to Patong, Night Patong. All the massage shops and restaurants are there, weed shops, you name it, nightlife, uh, nightclubs, strip clubs, ping pong shows. Thank you for watching, guys. Cheers. Let me know in the comments what do you think about this video and would you stay in this resort or maybe you already stayed here. I'd like to know about your experience.